The service as per directive was held under two themes, President Gengob's dedication to education and his role as a statesman. Hage G. Gengob, who started off as a teacher, was dedicated to education, prompting the Ministry of Education to honor his legacy. He began his teaching career at Sume Primary School in the Oshikoto region, but later pursued further education abroad, driven by a vision to reform the education system as detailed in his biography. Learners and staff expressed their feelings through poems and speeches, reflecting on the significant impact the late president had on the nation. Mark Givano, a teacher at the school, had a celebratory tribute of the late and described him as a man with only good vibes. Good vibes. It's about positive vibes. And uh, if he feels like things are not okay, he will express himself and truly say, I'm not in the mood of that. Or I will entertain it, but you give me time, I will, I will look at it later. But indeed, you will definitely look into what that is. The head girl of Hochland High spoke on behalf of the Furler learners. I feel incredibly privileged to be able to honor our late president. Our president was a steadfast leader, dedicated with unwavering commitment and passion. As we mourn this profound loss, let us honor his memory by carrying forward his spirit of leadership, kindness and inclusivity. Partially hidden by clouds, the sun created a solemn atmosphere over the capital, causing a pause in time at Auckland High School as the education community grieved the loss of their esteemed educator, Dr. Hage G. Gengop. Johanna Urikos, NBC News, Ventuk. Mm-hmm.